What's good guys, I'm Zombie Gaming here again and welcome back to another episode of No Man's Sky. Guys, we're back and I am absolutely in love with this game guys. This game is so fun. Uh, we've got a cargo drop here, my inventory is full, let's see if we can send anything back. Even though I did just get that free inventory slot, let's just send the Gek Charm away. So we can see what this is. Fascination bead, nice. We get some plutonium. Awesome. But welcome back to the grind, guys. The No Man's Sky grind. I'm super pumped. I'm super pumped. I'm, I'm loving this game, and uh, I figured out a way to record it. Some very light like now. Um, and we're going to go to the waypoint, and I think we're going to try and circle back to, uh, to the uh, starship. We definitely want to head there. But guys, this this reminds me. I think I, I've just been thinking about this game so far, and I think I understand, you know, why I love it. You know, when I was a kid, I would always play with like stuff like Bionics. If you guys know what those are, they're like the OG Lego um, build sets. And I remember not one of those, even though they were for like I don't know. I, I just for this for, for eleven and up. Um, like I, I would I would oh hello. Hey jerk. How's it going? Duh out of here, son. Um, but even when like oh hello. Hello. 50% oh oh yo 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 yo. We are freezing to death. Alright, there we go. Okay. Ooh. Hopefully we can get in some warm here. But the Bionicles, they have their own world, and, um, like, when I was, I was, like, seven or something, and up, so I, I, you know, I, I convinced my dad to get me and my brother one for our birthday, when we were, like, eight, I think, um, and it was just really cool, and they had this own world, and I, I watched the movies and everything that, that came out with them, um, it was just so cool, it was just so cool, and, uh, you know, it was, it was, it was a world that you could track and adventure in, and, cool, there we go, nice. Restore shield. Hello! Shield at maximum power. Restore health. Health at maximum. Nice, dude. It reminds me of Half-Life. It's Half-Life up in here, boys. Analyze multi-tool tech. <gasps> beam focus sigma. Faster mining beam. Okay! Alright. No life in here, it seems. Now, what is this? Interact Gek Observatory. The life form that works or worked is in this in this installation left its equipment scanning the skies for interesting new systems and spatial phenomena. In its absence, it struck gold. A beacon has been received and a transmission sequence awaits response. What do I do? Two two or two one two two one one two sounds cool. The machines remain remain dormant and the skies remain silent. Dang it, dude, can I do that again? Freaking nuggets, man! Dang it! I wanted to do that. Shoot, dude. But yeah, it's just, it's it's my world. And I get to explore it, you know, the way I want. And, you know, there's mysteries around every corner. And I think that's so cool. You know, there's stuff that is just waiting to be explored. Bypass chip. Oh, I can call my starship? No, I would totally do that. I would totally my starship in the exact same spot. For the entirety of of this let's play so far we haven't moved it and I'm, i assume i can fly what is going on i assume i can fly around the planet like that's 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 possible right i assume i can dude there's two beacons like right here and and not only like bionicle uh, reminds me but like zelda i played the crap out of zelda when i was a kid it was just this huge unknown world that was so much bigger and you got to take it on, and you got to see, you know, the secrets that it that it holds, and uh, that is just that's just exactly what this game for. You know, I can't wait to find out some of the the cool stuff that we have yet to even come close to. So, anything nearby? Ooh, this might actually be useful if we want to get some heridium. Um, actually, I don't even know what this is. What is this? No, we still got mo upgrade multi tool. Okay, this is Nick's open. Oh, okay, I need. I think we have Heridium. I think we have Heridium at our at our. So I don't think we're. We should be worried about this. No free free slots in Starship either. Heridium, 
do we have Iridium in our starship? We've got 50 out of 500. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna ditch something here. We've got 250 out of 250. That should be enough iron. Um, there you go. Plutonium, we've got a lot of plutonium. Plutonium's pretty useful. Platinum, I don't think. Uh, let's get rid of titanium first. So let's get some Heridium. Because that's gonna be useful. And Famium 9, is that what it's called? Is something that we need to charge our plasma uh, thruster or whatever that is. Uh, plasma cannon something. Um, and I know it's not like a necessary thing, I don't think. Um, but it would be nice to, 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 to get, um, to get some stuff, like, to get some stuff to be able to fuel that up. Um, because we got, we've gotten some technology while we're here. It's, it's pretty cool. We've gotten some cool technology, which is, which is awesome. Um, so let's just get as much of this as we can. Are we, okay, we already have a full stack, so that's all I'm gonna, that's all I'm gonna take. It's just a full stack. Uh, where's the starship? Starship's that way. So we're gonna keep on, keep on kind of heading our way back. Um, and if we don't, anything on the, might be time to leave soon. I want to assess our situation, though. I want to see what's, what's happening. But what do we need mo? What do we need to keep our stuff fueled? Because I don't know how long it's gonna take us to get to a new planet. I don't know. So if, if, if there's nothing, then... Or if we have everything, is what I mean, then we're probably, we're probably all right to keep going and and head off world. But this, man, what is this? Nah, nah, I don't, I don't want you, boy. Get out of here. Um, I, I just, I don't want to leave yet. You know, I feel like this, this planet, like the setting that we're in with and every so cool. Yeah, sure, it's barren, and I really would like to find some, uh, like some aquatic you know, planets, but I don't, I just, I'm sorry if you got me leave. Maybe, maybe like, this is episode three so far, so maybe, I don't know, five will be the last one here? Just depends, really. Zinc, can we take you? Yes, we can. Zinc, I feel like, is super useful. It's not the most common. It's definitely not the most common. Okay, this, this area is familiar to me. See, is that the Sentinels approaching or whatever? You get out of here, dude. Because I know zinc is yellow. Zinc is like a yellow metal bar. I c Platinum, I, is, um, I don't know like what to use it for yet, but I feel like it can sell for a lot. So we're just going to pick... Oh, Thamium 9! <gasps> Yo, okay, so we got 20. Is there more? Is there more? It's So Thamium 9 has the ex... As... As carbon. Or as an isotope, I guess. That's, that's the icon for it. Ooh, I want that, man. I want more of it. Where's it going? What's it going, man? Aw, look at these guys. I'm gonna fuck you so I super disrupt your entire colony right now. But, dude, that is so cool. I'm really found. At least we know kind of what it looks like. It's like a... A, uh... I don't call it. A power type looking thing. Um, nuns are... Well, this could be some. Uh, that might be it. I don't know. That might just be... No. Thamium 9, yes! Okay, little bulbs hops. We've got 40. 40 right now. I would like to get some more. And I want to go in. Because I know my starship. Oh, it's right here. Okay, yeah, I was going to say. In this little valley area here. Uh, but I want to I wanna go up and over that mountain just to kind of, you know, see what happens. You know? All right, so we're back. And I don't think I'm going to leave yet. I never even got. <laughs> uh, okay, Alice Pass V1. With all my stuff in it. Um, okay, uh, spaceship. Spaceship, spaceship, spaceship. Or starship, I should say. So, um, uh, let me open up the inventory. So we're here, and let me charge this with whatever we have. Let's just charge it up. Okay, so that's it. That's all we got. Um, I am gonna take this. I want to, I want that, that, this on on my person at all times um nickel i feel like we really don't need oh uh by that i meant discard it um zinc we definitely need i'll take it and stack it with everything else iron if i can i'll stack it with everything else okay inventory is full um let's put everything like the iron and the zinc and the plutonium 
all that stuff. We'll keep the Platinum and the Heridium. Actually, if we can put the Heridium on there. Wow, we've got a lot of room in our Starship. All right, nice. Um, so what do we need this for? We need Plutonium. Well, my friend, I have got Plutonium. Photon Cannon. Okay, so I can facilitate rapid ship-to-ship -ship destruction. Oxide elements. So that's iron that we can we can protect ourselves with if we run into any trouble. Uh, we got some Gek Charms. I think I think we're good to go. That doesn't mean I'm leaving. <laughs> I think we're okay. And we saved our game, so that's good. That's really, 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 really nice. Um, aha, I knew it. I knew it. So those appear about when you're, when you're uh, in 10 seconds. This vegetation looks different. So we've got an isotope over there. If it's Thamium-9, I want it. Or Thamium, I don't know how to pronounce it. Uh, we do want this most likely, though. If this, yep. And if there's some... Oh, this is uh, Plutonium? Dude, I'll take it. Uh, no. Okay, that gives me 45. There's, like, a bigger spike that gives me 100 that I remember getting. Okay, these guys. Can I feed Dude, you're my friend. You're my friend. Hey, buddy. Aw. Dude, he's freaking adorable. Those guys are my pals, dude. I'll feed them, man. If it helps keep them alive, I mean, I, they probably can't die unless attacked by a style creature. But, you know, I feel I like to feel like I'm helping them. I think we're on iron, so I think we have iron. Look at this giant, this giant mountain. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, we're climbing freaking Mount Kilimanjaro, guys. All right, uh, plutonium's super useful. So if this is, okay, this is Thamium-9, so we need this. Thamium-9 and Thamium are super life super. Um, so definitely, dude, you can see, like, it looks like it's the wind's blowing up here, and it's, ooh, ooh. A little fog down below. We're climbing Mount Kilimanjaro, guys. That is the plan of attack today. Well, hello, guys. I've already discovered you, I assume. Hey, boys. Good to see you. I like on this pool. I probably would like the life on on planet, you know, um, that I find, or any first planet that I find. Because, you know, first, um, and I don't know how many we're going to explore. I'd like to keep going for as long as possible. Let's see if anything is growing up here. Hey, some platinum is. And some isotopes, so probably some M9 that we can. Let's get platinum. Want? Uh, there looks to be. Ooh, dude, this place is so cool. Yes, Thamium 9. Hey, buddy. There we go. Need you. Need. You are very useful to us. What is this? Uh, titanium. I think we need it. I know what it looks like though. It's the the yellow spikes, basically plutonium. Do I already know? Yeah. Hey guys, how's it going? That's iron. There's so much iron just missing. Oh, hello. Power canister, nice. Okay, that's plutonium. Oh. Well, that's plutonium, at least. Not really worth it picking those up, to be honest, though. Alright, uh... When we were... Hey, dude. I assume it was. Now, where is it? I totally just lost it. Right over here. Okay. So, we, we kind of got a little sidetracked. You guys are probably like, yo... Getting a little bit sidetracked there, zombie, but that's alright. That's exploring, you know? That's the name of this game, is to explore. And make your way to the center of the universe. Hello, hello! So, so that these are... The first outpost that we found. Rokunga Point. Rok Mount Rokunga. See, I am a pioneer, guys. I am a pioneer of my time. And that feels... It's just such a cool feeling, you know? This this area is ours. And the debris stuff... Oh, Corvax Convergence Cube... What? Okay, we're getting a lot of useful stuff here. Uh, let's save this right here. Boom, baby. Mount Rokunga. Or Rokunga Point. I don't know what to call it, man. They're both... It, Rokunga Point is a place on Mount Rokunga. Was that it? 143? Nah, I don't think so. But let's see what's here. Hello? Anybody? Analyze me. Ooh, Accelerant Sigma. Bolt caster ammunition reload times are decreased. Okay, that's cool. That's awesome. Sick. Uh, there's some beds. Can I sleep in those? Doesn't look like it. So this is just... So these all have little, uh, you know, multi-tool technology or or something of the sort. Oh, this is here too, dude. Oh. Boom! Oh, wait, 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 what? Planetary location beacons are responding. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So I get to choose one of these? Colonial outposts? I don't think a transmission. Shelter, maybe. 
I'm thinking, ooh, but Monolith sounds so cool. Monolith sounds so cool. Hmm. I don't know what to do, guys. Should we? We're risking it. Monolith. Show me. Oh, it's searching for them. Do we find one? Alien monolith detected. Ooh, six minutes away. So we're definitely gonna have to go explore that. Ooh, ooh, baby. So it's it's permanently unidentified presence confirmed. Ooh, see, that's what I want, guys. What? I, that's what I wanted. I want to see that monolith, guys. Way to it. Plutonium and more zinc over here. Always worth picking up. And this this place, uh, these look like cactuses. Uh, I, didn't, I haven't really talked about that, but they definitely look like which is what I've thought of them this entire time. Alright, let's go. Let's go. I'm excited now. I want to see... You know, I don't know what, what kind of stuff that that's going to hold. I don't know what it's going to get us, but I hope it's cool. Life support systems at 75%. I th definitely think we're good. All we have to do is shoot up some... Uh, oh. Some carbon here, and we'll be, sur be surviving. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Just destroy some cactus, get some carbon. We're good to go. Now, see, if there is a map feature, I haven't found it yet. I tried M. Um, I'll definitely look it up. Uh, I've been super busy, so it hasn't really crossed my mind to look it up. But that's definitely what I'll do next in terms of uh, of looking up, you know, seeing if there is a map. I don't know why they would have a map. Okay, we're going back around the other side. Where is Starship? Starship is that way. No, we're going even further this way. How far is away is it? 441, dude, it's worth it. This this thing's far away. Okay, so I pass. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, let me check if it used my my um, my um thing. I think it did. It did. Okay, so that is a one-time use. But that's cool. It pointed me in the in the direction of this bad boy. A little bit of a K thing. Mm. All right, so we've got four minutes and 20 seconds until we find this monolith. I think it's worth it. I want to find it. I want to find it, and I, I assume it pointed me to the closest one. I assume all day. Okay. All right, game. Whatever you want. It doesn't seem like there is, at least on this planet, doesn't seem like there's a huge risk of death. Which is, you know, it makes it a little friendlier to, to player. Um, you know, just starting out, and I hope, I, I'm glad, you know, I hope that that's something that they include in, uh, you know, starting planet for people, because... You know, getting a chance to to do that and have you know just to get just a feel for the game. Flora, your shield increases. Awesome. It's nice. Now I don't know what that red that red there like a shield. That con in the bottom right. It looks like a shield, and I assume it's a shield. But I don't know. It's still red, even though it, it increases. Maybe it's only white if it's if it's that. I don't know. Um, sure. Uh, but again, we're not at a risk of dying quite yet, so I think we're okay for the start. We're still heading over there. What timing does it say we've got? Two minutes and 32 seconds. Don't know if we'll get to it in this episode. I'm, I want these are minutes. Um, and it would be cool to find that for the next episode and kind of leave it as a uh, as a cliffhanger for you guys. And then we've got another little bit I probably will end up going to. Or, ooh, I think I see it. I think I see I, Ooh. Ooh, I can't wait for this, guys. I can't wait. But I think that is going to do it for episode three of No Man's Sky. Hopefully, have been oh, hey, there's shelter over there, too. I didn't even see that. Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool. All right, but yeah, that's going to do it for us today. Next time, we are heading over to the monolith, and it's going to be sick. I can tell you guys that much. At least I hope. So that's going to do it for us today. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching and supporting this game. Glad we got the frame rate issues and everything. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying this series. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. And as always, I'm Zombie Gaming MC, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!